Hello everyone, my name is Nexus71C, and today we're going to be playing some Soma, mostly because people voted for it. And uh, today is base. Okay, today was supposed to be like a chill Friday, except it's Friday the 13th. Well, now it's not. Now it's Saturday the 14th, but <laughs> uh, my timing on streams are really weird. So, in honor of the fact that it was Friday the 13th, we'll be playing horror again. And people did bring up that I probably should have played some, like, Jason Voorhees-esque, but I don't really have any games like that. I mean, I do have one, but it's, like, extremely buggy, and there's, like, there hasn't been an update for it, in, like, since it came out, I guess. Or at least since the last one was, like, way long ago. So it's, it wouldn't be worth it. It's not even a streamable game. It's, like, it's a game that you would much rather record and stream. Which I did record. But yeah, before we begin, I'm uh, doing some currently, but yeah. Just a note, this stream is not going to be very long. I don't really plan to stream for very long, because I'm going to be doing other stuff later. So for the moment, we're going to be doing a short stream playing this, and it's basically a teaser to what's to come, because this can become another game that we can, rep that we can have for most of our days, because... Right now it's in Last of Us, which this entire week I've been streaming, so sorry. But it's been Last of Us so far, and whenever we're doing Last of Us, we can continue playing this, but that is up to everyone else. I also have this, and I have Ocarina of Time 3D, and a bunch of other games that I need to finish. So, up to all of you. Can't find the thingy. What's the thingy? The unfollow button? One sec while I do this. <laughs> okay, this is going to take a minute just for me to do this one thing. I think we both know where the unfold button is, <laughs> right? You need to find the thingy that basically... Check Discord. Yeah, I've been checking Discord. You need to find the thingy that links to the other thingy that allows you to do this thingy. Basically. Okay, well we're going to go ahead and start this game so we can just go ahead and go for it. The reason why it's this continue game is I started up the game to test it to make sure I could actually play it. Because my computer is a little iffy on some games. So, I want to make sure that this would be stream worthy. And it's alright. Yeah, go ahead. New game. Of course, this game is also the... It was created by the exact same people. <laughs> uh, this was created by the exact same people who made it Amnesia, so... You could pretty much expect some good stuff. I forgot how to do this. <laughs> yeah, it's a lot different than what it used to be. And if no one knows what we're talking about, we're talking about this client that... Me and him are going to be using to do stuff. Yeah. Are you okay, Simon? I think nope. you're bleeding. Oh, that, that's up. nothing. It's just my brain can't stop bleeding from the accident. Here, take this. No, that that's for later, for the scan. Okay, there, I turned it down. So that, that looked really loud to me. Actually, I need to tell you something. Honey, please don't make this weird. No, no, it's not like that. Hmm. Why now? Who's David Lynch? Why is there never enough time? Time for what? For what? Yeah, my, my question exactly. <laughs> it's a cryptic beginning. Cryptic intros. Pretty sure no one ever wakes up in a smiling yeah, manner. Brain scan. I remember. Are you all right? Yeah, yeah, just a 
bad dream. Are, are we still on for today? Yeah, that's why I'm calling. This guy's fingernails look disgusting. Don't worry, I I got it somewhere. Okay, great. Well, see you in a couple of hours then. Okay, see you soon. One of the most quickest phone calls ever, especially with like a doctor or whatever. Okay. Uh, how's the mouse sensitivity? That's that's all right. Okay. Let me just see what all we got in here. Oh yeah, cam, because we want that. What that one? Alright, hooked on what? Hmm. I feel like this is going to be one of those games where I need to put on my glasses because I won't be able to read it. Mark and Diana... Mil Wait, Mark and Diana Miller has finally caught a break. Is that proper grammar? That does not look like proper grammar. They've managed to save up enough money to take the family on that vacation to Hawaii. They've been talking about for so long, but as the sun sets over Waikiki Beach that first day, Mark and Diana's, th this already sounds boring, <laughs> Mark and Diana's, uh, what? Paradise turns into a nightmare as swimmers are caught in thousands of thin strings stretching from somewhere below the waves. Slowly swimmers are pulled Screaming into the dark way. Wait. Water. Jeez. I can't read. Hello, Sweden. Desperate to get out of harm's way, that. Oh, wait. Their seven year old son, Charlie, is caught by the. Wait. The vicious tendrils. Suspenseful, mystical, and absolutely terrifying. Hooked will pull you in. Well, honestly, so far it's not. Oh! Well, that'll be nice to know. I didn't know you could middle click. I didn't know you can click it and it would actually tell you what it says. Well, that's just great. Did not know that. <laughs> I should have done that. Point is, that already sounds boring to me. Okay, nothing there. No, no I already, I already opened you. I want to open this? Can I open the middle drawer? Okay. Hey, sir. I have an answer machine. Stream late. Eh. Hold on. Like no subtitles. All right now. sent an email to remind him, didn't I? Mm hmm. Don't ask me. I just got here. What's that? Wait, do what? Oh. What do I Is this a flash drive? Just keep that a little close. Okay. <laughs> now let's look at the emails, I guess. Thank you again for participating in the research. The scan will be performed at the, the Pace Laboratories in Toronto, but since we are since we are a guest, our access is a bit unpredictable. I will try to schedule a scan session for Saturday. I'll get back to you when confirmed. Sincerely, David Munchi. So Oh. Ah. Wait. What? I'm confused enough. Uh, I don't feel like reading all this. Let's see. Also, you're gonna keep. Oh, my bad. Architect is not telling me crap. <laughs> <laughs> He's probably not even paying attention. My bad. Sorry about that. It happens. I forget things. Okay, here we go. Hi, Jesse. Since you probably forgot, here's me reminding you that I've got. Oh. At the point of mom not coming into work. This means you need to make sure you're actually on time to open up the store. And please unpack the boxes behind the counter. They are starting to become a workplace hazard. Also, books tend to. 
sell much better if they're put on shelves where people are able to actually see them. Good luck, you'll need it, Simon. Yeah, sure, send that. Even though, you know. Better late than never. Nope, nope. Just, there we go. Right click. Now what you got? Am I not able to read that? No. I'm like, left clicking, it's not reading it. Will soon love mom. All right. Okay, looks like it's not important over here. Right. Okay. Watching TV gives me headaches now. Thank you, brain. Hmm. Pretty sure that's how it always goes. Massive recoil. What's it about? John Hugh is. Corrupt cob working in Hong Kong. One day his life is turned upside down as he meets Amber, a mysterious foreigner who is kept prisoner by the Golden Dragon Triad. Get ready to go rogue for his time to go against the Triad, the police, and the supernatural forces of the underground. Get ready for Master Rico. What is this person even doing? Best 10 minutes or something on the video later. Yeah. Right? <laughs> okay, we're gonna go look for whatever I'm supposed to be looking for. Tracer fluid? That's what the guy was talking about? Is it in there? Hello? No. Alright. Oh, but the lower one. Nope. And that one? Nope. Nope. About in here. Will you though? I doubt it. Look at that pizza, bro. <laughs> Alright. Where the hell is the tracer fluid? There's the keys. The guy said something about like, oh hey, get a uh, tracer fluid. I just need to pick up meds, flowers for funeral. Okay. Seriously. Where's the crap that I was supposed to be taking? Supposed to be some kind of like fluid that I'm supposed to drink, and then I go off to this place. Summer's coming. Let's keep it warm. I don't know. I'm not much of a summer fan myself, so hmm. maybe it's in here. It's like a medicine cabinet. No. Okay. That's a surprise. Well, as I said, this is the only game that successfully scared me, so I stopped playing it. <laughs> All right. The frickin' hell is this fluid? Yeah, let me turn on that light. That's, that's reasonable. Just gonna open it up. I well, imagine it's gonna be like, well, that's like leaving the place. Well, I want the fluid, don't I? Oh, wait, what's this? I don't know. It's something there. On a towel. Am I sure I like checked everything? No. The pipes. It's oven. No. Not in there. It's like a red fluid, isn't it? Not in the microwave. The glass. Wait, what? What was that? Oh, it's turned on the light. This guy needs a clean. Then again, what am I talking about? <laughs> I'll make a Java version of the server client. Um, I mean, doesn't it use Node.js? Like, I think that's what it uses for its server. Or, or at least for the server part of it. Yeah. Pretty sure that's what it does. So I didn't. Okay, you know I'm gonna try to leave. It'll probably be like, oh, I need to find the trace fluid first. Quick drink of tracer fluid before I go see Dr. Yeah. Nishi. Yeah, my point. Now where is it? Clayton, where is it? <laughs> you played the game before. You should know. 
people who play the game always know, even if it's been many days. That is not how that's supposed to work. I threw that crap. Look at this. That is not how glass works. That should have shattered. That should have shattered. Mapping Minds, Albert Isaacson. Oh my god. Ugh, you're gonna give me a headache at this rate. <laughs> yeah, um, yeah, I've not played it in a bit of a year. Okay, well then. Yeah, I don't know where it is. I've looked in every drawer, every place, and he hasn't mentioned anything about the fluid. No fluid. Nope, don't need no sunglasses. I don't need that. Can I can I close the thank you. It's not that. You under here? Nope. Seriously, where the hell is this stupid fluid? I have looked everywhere. Get out of my way, chair. I swear it's gonna be somewhere where I'm not paying attention. Oh, that's cool. It's gonna leave all the electronic stuff on, so it's just gonna run up my bill. Check your bed or the fridge. Well, I've checked my bed, and I can't really do anything about that. And as for the fridge, no, no. There goes food. That needs to get back in there. No, hmm, sir. Mm. Yeah, get right there. That works. Thank you very much. Aha. That it. No, that's that's just the condiment bottle. You can't be serious. Not there, I've already checked. I about to say, I was trying to open that, it didn't work. No. You in there, buddy? No. This you? No. This guy has too many glasses everywhere. Red, but it's not the red I'm looking for. This guy's place is going to be ransacked soon. I want to look for a freaking fluid that somehow he lost. Like, buddy, keep better track of your things. Ch check of the TV. That's about right. Can I? Yeah, yeah. I already know about ma about the re massive recoil. Can I unplug the TV? Does that work? I mean, I turn on the TV. There's no disc. So what? Do I need to watch TV and then boom, there it is. Because that's not realistic. I throw it away. No, I didn't. Are you in one of these drawers in which I've already looked at? I didn't look at that, actually, but whatever. None of you are the tracer fluid. But this one is like a red liquid. Apparently, I'm blind, because there it is. I don't know if well, they're only like 30 minutes down the drain. Feels like no proper taste. It's like sucking on honey. Thank you for the, uh, you know, deal. Oh, yeah, and that's the, uh, that's the stuff that we're going on about. Yep, that happened. I'm not reading it. I'm getting out of here. I want out of this mess. I mean, geez, we're still in this freaking room, not even in the scary parts of the game, because it took me 30 minutes just to freaking find fluid that was in his desk. The whole time. And I checked. Jesus. Hey there. How you doing, buddy? And you? 
You? Okay. Well. It's one thing about a bus. It's awkward. Hmm? Jesse the Grimoire. Jesse. Hey, it's Herman. I got you in Trail Blue. Just wanted to wish you good luck and to let you know we got you covered. Thanks. I should be able to come to the store after this game. Don't sweat it. I got Maddie Trix helping me out. Maddie from SNL? That's Ashley's job. Yeah. Well, she's the main girl. Forget it. I'm not doing her any favors by leaving an empty spot. Not like she's coming back. Well, good you luck. are not a very nice person, aren't you? You know, this dying thing. <laughs> this dying thing? You're the worst support ever. <laughs> That's about right. Don't worry, it will be later, scary. Jesse. Whatever. Don't burn the place down while I'm gone. Over and out, buddy. <laughs> Seriously, though, just like. Not exactly the best way to talk about, uh, the, you know, the friend of yours that just died. I mean, really. I mean, he was just talking about, you know, the friend Ashley, who is the person who died in the car crash. And yet, he's just all, you know, you know, not coming back. Da -da -da, just a little in about that. Yeah, this place looks Hello? great. Dr. Munchie? Probably brighten up the game a little bit, but eh, it's okay. Pfft, I don't know the friggin' code. Where is everyone? I thought this place would be busy. That's what you would think. Paul, where are you? We've got a few hours. I got a hold of Simon Jarrett. Let's do this. I saw your laptop in the reception. Are you already here? Call me ASAP. Uh, hey, Paul, talk to Pace about using the lab this week. I've managed, uh, okay, da, 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 okay. Right. Nobody told us about the code change, so I called security. Talk to okay, that's just great. So I gotta look for a code. So it's probably in the desk somewhere. Two five zero one. Okay, we'll go try that. Two five zero one. Yep. Well, shift while moving to run. Yay! I need to run to the open door because that's right. Ooh, nice brain. Statistics. Let me just turn the light on here. Got some uh, servers going up in here. Cool, cool. Shut that door. Deadly room, which is locked. Should be about right. Oh, and here we are. Oh, oh there's Munchie. I didn't hear you come in. Simon Jarrett, right? Dr. Munchie? Well, it's uh, just Mr. Munchie, but I'm working on it. Actually, you're helping me right now. Is this part of your thesis mm. work? Yeah, it's a study I'm doing with my nah, colleague. dark. Albert. Make it more horrific. Of course. A gentle way to work with brain reconstruction. Sounds no, horrific. Right. Horrific. Oh, did you uh, <laughs> take the tracer fluid? Yes. Yes, I did. Great. Well, we can start whenever you're ready. So, what exactly are we doing? We're going to do a scan of your brain. Then we build a computer model of it and bombard it with stimuli. The program will help us to quickly iterate your treatment plan until it's fully optimized. In short, develop the perfect treatment for your condition. So it's not just a study, this will actually help me. No, I should hope so. Otherwise, this would be a huge waste of time. <laughs> oh, aren't you just peachy? Well, we're gonna go ahead and sit down. And you magically teleported over there to the computer. Horrific. Yes. <laughs> Sounded so annoying. <laughs> Speaking of darkness. Oh, there we go. All right. Let me just get this out of the way. You are Simon Jarrett, correct? Right. Uh, Canada, Dr. Munchie. Born 
1988, July 16th. Right. Latin Neurograph. Mm. Good. All files in order. Will this hurt? It's just a scan. This guy's almost 40. I mean, he's almost 30. Indians thought cameras Excuse would steal <laughs> their souls. That's dumb. Uh. Well, let's hope they're wrong. <laughs> Ready? Save P. Yeah. Like I said. So... Almost, this guy's basically almost 30 as of right now, is what I'm saying. Because it'll be like a few months then he is. Going off of my, my deal. Oh. What happened? Hello? Apparently plenty. Mr. Munchie? Yep, get on out of the chair, buddy. Did something go wrong? Okay, I literally can't see crap. I'm sorry, I do need to turn it up just a little bit. Uh, if I can find it. Oh, gamma. Just a little bit. That should be good. This isn't funny. I probably did nothing. I mean, the game is honestly dark in the first place. Oh, I'm not supposed no. to put myself in. Hey, who is this fucker? How did I get here? Well, we all know. Insert Omni tool to access. Well, let's go find the Omni tool. Which I believe I remember what that looks like. I have seen uh, gameplays of this game. It just I don't really remember much of it in the first place. I just remember seeing gameplay. Uh, unlock terminal from service console. Well, we need the Omni tool for that. Is it going to be a five hour hunt like it was last time? Or are we going to be able to find this in like two seconds? Because, you know, that'd be nice. Okay, same thing. All around. Hm, this is not needed. It's not like there's a fire or anything. Make sure. Uh, both ship and optimize your army tool with fully customizable tools and assistance. Yeah, I read that. Oh, toolbox. Cool. Where is that? All right, there, which is on axis. Well, okay then. What am I missing here? Oh. Okay. That was cool. Is that me moving or is someone else moving? Probably me. But seriously though, where the hell is this Omni tool? Again, it's just me searching for things for like five hours straight. That is the point of these games, right? Search for stuff. Because I'm stupid. Hmm. You got me. I have no clue what I'm doing. I keep wanting to press escape, even though it's just right click.
Nope, nothing in any of those. Not a floor panel. Yeah, so far this game is uh, hard for idiots. Yeah, I get it. Toolbox. For any idiot out there, you are going to be screwed. Because I'm an idiot, and I sure as I can't figure it out. <laughs> There's no, like, pocket deal over here or anything. Look over here. It's like they just expect you to know things these days. Like, people expect to, like, oh, hey, you'll totally know. Maybe... Maybe you need to learn how to break a window for once. You know how it is, right? Yeah, that happened. Again, being an idiot, right? Whoa. It's looking better than expected. They're having a really hard time getting the doors open. Call Permaskill as many as you can. Revan don't take any chances. Roger. Did you cut off the factory floor? All done. Should keep most of them out. I'm on my way to lock off the comp set. Just make sure to leave a way out of here. Trust me, I'll get you to stay in a safe and sound. We just need to make sure we're leaving our power running so we don't have to return. I hear that. See you back at camp. How do I do that? Got me, buddy. Hold on just a second. Okay. I'm gonna try not to waste any time now. We're gonna try to do this as quick as humanly possible. Oh, whoa, no, no, no. Open that back up. Don't know why I even pressed the button. Door was open. Ready to go. Gotta find that Omni tool. It's like blood, but oily. Because that's what it is. It's oil. Well, looks of it. And okay, it doesn't look like there's anything here. Is this a stupid lounge room? I guess so. The restrooms. Nothing in the restroom, right? Looked up the toilet. It's a weird future toilet. Okay, then. Hmm. I'm probably gonna run into somebody. Not think about it. Pneumatic seal. Hmm. Bet they had this place locked off for a reason. But, hey, I don't know things. I'm an idiot. I just walk in here without thinking. Okay. We gotta shut you down now, okay? Yeah, you're creepy as hell. So I'm gonna shut you down. Oh, there's me melding into stuff. Hello? Who's there? Totally heard that. Okay. 
Thank you for, you know, random jump scare, which probably means nothing, but at the same time, probably means something. What? Okay, I thought I heard <laughs> like someone talking. The robotic voice. So long time ago, I played this. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh let's, uh... Offline terminals, nothing here, okay. Oh, well, thank you for telling me that now. Just gonna go this way now. Don't mind me, I'm just a fellow human. Hello, human in this, you know, area. <laughs> yeah. You you didn't hear anything. Just open the door. Hello. Am I just dying here? I heard screams. I got the Omni tool finally. I imagine I'm good. Use tab to use inventory. Okay, I'm pressing tab. Now what? Okay. You got me. Well, anyway, it's there. So I got the Omni tool I needed. Now it's about time I walk away with the remaining dig I mean not dignity, uh, sanity that I have left. I mean, it's not amnesia, I don't lose sanity, but still. This guy does have a brain, like, you know, extreme brain damage, so that always works too. Okay, yeah, thank you. Thank you for being creepy. Can I get back to the place I just was in? Not where I'm going now, I'm talking about like the broken window area, okay. Where is the broken window area? Right here, okay. You excuse me, I'm just not gonna pay attention to any of that. Just go ahead and put that in there. That's right, read that Omni tool. And you still are insane, maybe. Oh, sweet. System status. Warning remote access denied. Servers offline. Main power suspended. Initiate the setup. Program unavailable. Denied. Emergency systems. Thir 13 days remaining. Ooh, that does not sound good. We progress that whole thing. Oh. Well, it's us. Simon Jarrett. Terminal scan. Nice front. It's basically all the other stuff. Yep. Omni tool. Well, unlock the toolbox. Inventory. Oh, all right. Dang it. Nope. All right. Oh, toolbox is unlocked. And now we got a tool. Alright, I'll well, manage that tool chip. Update it. Please remove the Omni tool. Okay. Wait. Can I put it back in? And No, I guess that's all I need to do. I was going to say manage the Cortex chip, but, you know. Ah. I clearly already took it out. What's over here then? Because this probably got unlocked. Oh yeah, the pilot seat in progress. Interesting. Interesting. Alright, wait, wait a minute. Okay, for a second there, that looks like base 64, but I'm not sure about that. Construct network. That's offline pilot status, no pilot found. Pilot back box. 
for status. Okay. Wait. Orcs. Okay. Alright then. Alright, well, <laughs> he said that that guy was knocked out for 30 hours. I believe I was knocked out for about 8 million. I'm in the future. Or, whatever the hell. I mean, I'd imagine the future, because like we had modern day technology and now we got all this crap. And that music does not sound very nice. Sounds like we're about to run into someone. Just gonna crouch around, you know. Don't want people to notice me. Nah, just kidding. I'm gonna walk. Make things fast. Now I wanna crouch, because that doesn't look nice. <laughs> okay. You have fun over there, bud. I'll be fine with what you're looking for. I want to go this way. That was loud. Oh. Underwater. Yep. That's about usual. Oh crap, no, 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 go back, go back. I, I like backed out. <laughs> eh, I'm not scared. <laughs> I backed out so I didn't get to hear the whole dialogue. Well, apparently we're definitely one of the crazy things, except we're not machine. Alright. Hmm, love you fish. Another one. Like a shark looking one. That looks lovely. Drawings. It shows people are not crazy for once. Water bottles. Yeah, we can totally use those when we're surrounded by it. Get a desalination tank and we're all good what who no understand what uh uh don't even okay Why would you even try doing that? <laughs> don't think you were told to stick your finger into random things. I don't think that's how things work in the real world. You don't do that, buddy. That's how you get things. You know, like diseases and such. Put your fingers where it's not supposed to go. Do, 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 do. It's crawling through the vents when there's a giant light source that way. And now it's that way. Alright, gonna go this way then. Ow, hold on. Your arm just like started itching like crazy. Well, I'm not going that way. That's red. Do you crawl any faster, bro? You're like the slowest crawler. Slower than a freaking 
Black Ops, or, you know, it's basically Call of Duty Crawler. Oh, I was just mentioning Black Ops. I mean, it was played before that. Alright, save in. There we go. We can totally open up this door. Beep. Oh, this looks lovely. Looks like I'm in the, like, most peaceful place in the world. Oh, it's moving. Hey, can you hear me? I want to take that as a no. Uh, bud, I'm sorry to do this to you, but, uh, kind of had to You're not talking to me. If you would have talked to me, maybe I wouldn't do this. Also, you're kind of blocking my power deal here, so That's not creepy at all. Okay. Sorry, robot lady, but uh, <laughs> I think I need the power more than you do. Also gonna head out and eat a sleep so I don't miss my time. Alright, well, have a good sleep while I take uh, robot lady off of life support. Because that's apparently what just happened. Oh shoot. Am I supposed to do this? Okay, I see. So it's like... Alright, so it's like green, no. Okay, so it's like this is first, but what am I supposed to do with it? It's like... Yes. Only three freaking switches here. Oh, okay. So they get all the way to it. Okay, never mind, I get it. Hmm. That is a lot of RPM. Unlocking. Some blew up. Wait a minute. Oh, what is it? What what's happening? Hello, is there anyone there? Hey, hey, can you hear me? I hear you. Uh, Absalon, what's going on? Uh, I, I have no idea. I, I just sort of woke up here. In a room right now? Uh, it, it's, it's like a, a seat with a helmet. Is that right? Uh, what's your name? I, I'm Simon Jarrett. And what do you... Ah, oh, signal... Damn, relays. Where are you now? Uh, uh, uh some place dealing with electrical power. I, I'm not sure if it's a plant or a transformer... Yeah, you're probably in the thermal plant somewhere. You want to go upstairs Most to likely. the comm center. It's the room with the dome ceiling. Uh, hey, look, look, this place is not... There's something seriously wrong here. Hello? I'm sorry, I didn't catch that. We lost another relay. Listen, head for the comm center upstairs. I'll wait here. 
Okay. Question is, where is upstairs? Well, probably this way. Hmm. What time is it? One o'clock. Uh, I want to say maybe one more hour, and then we'll stop this stream. Because, like I said, I don't want to go too far in this stream. Either one more hour or 30 minutes, whichever one I deem fit. Ah, nope. <laughs> what? What are you? What in the hell are you? Hi. You didn't see some guy go up these steps. You don't see these this guy going up these steps. You don't see a guy going across this what? With this uh railway. That's clearly broken. You clearly see those things. Okay. Yeah, I'm out. I'm out here. No no. No thank you. Thank you, go bye. Uh actually never mind. It seems I'm in a pickle. Oh, well. You can't climb ladders, can you? Probably not. No, you but you broke it though. That's good to know. Where you at now? I have no idea. Hmm. Oh, there's the upstairs. Hey, buddy, thanks for, like, knocking me, like, giving me a limp, but, uh, I'm going upstairs. You have a nice day now. Thank you for mortally wounding me. Hey, hey bud, do you know how to unlock this thing? Because I sure as hell don't. I even hurt myself trying to get up here. Never mind, I figured it out. This is gonna hurt. Okay. I'm up here. Hurt like, a, hurt like hell getting up here, though. And you, you stay down there. I don't want you following me. I and mean, I'm already limping. Oh, God. Is there another thing I have to, like, you know... Take off life support. <laughs> okay, yep, you just do that. That gives me health. Wait, what? Who that? Whoa. Oh. What the hell happened to you? What are you talking about? Where are you? Are you blind? It's me, Carl. Carl Semke. Wrangler? Any of this sound familiar to you? I no, actually. Well, thanks for being so helpful. It's not like I'm knocked out on the floor or anything. Are you human? My name is Simon. Do you know anything about this place? Oh, you knew. That makes this slightly less weird. Look, I'm obviously hurt. If you see anyone else around, just tell them where I am. So, where are you exactly? Are you for real? I'm right here. See me waiting? Look at my hands. Hey, buddy. Okay, okay. I, I'm just, I'm just gonna be. I'm I'm not seeing you. I, I see a machine, a robot talking. What the hell are you looking at? I'm here. See? Uh, okay. I, I just didn't expect you to look like that. You really hung up on appearances, you know that? How did you hurt yourself? Not sure. Blacked out pretty bad. Can't remember how I got here. What do you remember then? I was in the pilot seat, remoting a UH. UH? A universal helper. You know, a robot. These things, but livelier. Anyway, I was just dealing with some heat shields, and that's my last clear memory. 
You were remote controlling a robot. We do it all the time. Robots are too unaware to deal with some stuff. Mm. Intuition doesn't grow on motherboards, you know. Did you maybe get trapped in the robot somehow? Your mind is pretty tightly wired to the helper, but man, it's pretty far fetched. I don't know about that. <laughs> but I think you might be trapped in a robot. I'm telling you, get your eyes checked. I'm right here. I see both my hands, both my feet. When you remote, all you see is like a video feed from the helper unit. Your own body is entirely out of the picture. If you see any others, just let them know where I am. I'm really hurting here. Go get some help. Okay. What the hell are you on about? What are you on about? What do you mean I'm sewage? Oh. Oh no. Just turn that back on. I can't move. Please. I I'm sorry. I I think I pulled the wrong lever. Oh, don't sweat it. Just get me a doctor. How do I stop this thing? I think the idea is you have to kill these guys, but... What do you think I'm trying to do? I'm trying to help you out, bro. Please tell Amy. I need help. Jeez. I wonder if there's actually a way to help this guy, because right now it seems like there's no way to help him. I can't move. Please. Hmm. I feel like the only way to do this is to kill him. Yet you keep saying that, and I keep trying to, you know, look around, but... Buddy, I don't see anything. Mm. I can't even open the door. What about this then? Is this where I came out of? I think this is where I came out of. Okay, he's dead. He's dead. Arl Sinkin. This is the guy. I better go warn him that, you know, his body's dead. <laughs> he's still alive, he's just hurt. I can't move. Maybe the mechanic makes more sense? You're trying to be fucking funny? Give me a medic! But you're a robot! Really? Do robots have legs, hands, a face? You're delusional! Okay, calm down. I, I won't- Get some fucking help! Deputy Holland! Hmm. I feel like he might have to die. I'll go check, but this is his dead body right here. Hold on. I want to try leaving. Just leaving him there, not doing the kill thing. This may not be the best idea. Mm, great. Yeah, I think he has to die. <laughs> I think it's like really necessary for him to. Because there is like nothing else I can do.
Well, I guess I'm killing Carl. Yeah, I guess I'm killing Carl. Oh boy. I mean, he's already dead, but I'm killing like his second body, I guess you could say. Sorry, bud. Well, let's hope this is all I can do. Sorry. I would quickly end it. Would quickly end it, but all I can do. I don't know what else to do besides kill him. Maybe I don't need to kill him. Let me go turn it back on. He's probably like really dangerously low. You okay? Hey. I probably didn't even need to do that. He was probably perfectly okay. Zero seven two two. I probably really didn't even need to do that. I probably just, you know, did something really stupid. Welp. I see now. So, I didn't technically need to kill him. There was a way not to kill him. It was to go back and turn off the power in that other section over there. Which is actually pretty close to where I am. Actually, no, I think this is him, the way I need to do that. Or it's this room that's locked. So, yeah, it is to kill him. I am so sorry, bro. But... <sighs> gotta run, gotta run, because I don't want to have to hear the screams. Think about it this way, buddy. You're already dead. Oh boy. Crypto data detection restore file. Sure, go ahead.
And now you're dead, Carl. Uh. And apparently that's my healing mechanism, which is weird. More link broken, manual input re required. Oh, man. We want Theta, right? Because we're Upsilon. Okay. I would call Site Upsilon from Site Upsilon. Alright. That Lambda? Dome ceiling. Oh, that's better. Simon, was it? Uh, Jared. Simon Jared. Hi, Simon. I'm Catherine. Have you figured out what's going on yet? Me? I was hoping you'd have some answers. I probably have some. What do you want to know? Where to even begin? I mean, what is this place? How did I get here? And, and why do the robots talk like they're people? Well, you're at Upsilon, clearly. Have you never been there before? Where do you work? The Grimoire in Toronto. Is that really important? No, I mean, where did you work at Tezo 2? I don't know what that is. That's unexpected. Did you come directly from Toronto? Yeah, I did. And it was very unexpected. Have you seen any people? Like, staff or field technicians? Only robots. Crazy ones. Except for one. I, I think he was in pain. I'm not sure what to do. He said he was hurting. Sort of. I don't know. Oh. Uh. is about to collapse. What do I do? Simon, come to Lambda. Uh, how, how do I get there? There are shuttle trains connecting all the sites. Find one and come here. I'll wait for you. Shit, shit, shit. Where do I... Where should I... Oh, fuck. Mm-hmm. And there we go. You are working underwater, my friend. OK, 
Okay, I'm not supposed to get up there. Oh, I see. The climb command. Oh, who needs to take a train to Lambda when I can walk there? Where's the Zeppelin transport? Which doesn't work. That's what I'm trying to figure out. Where is that at? Guess I'm not there. Hmm. Okay, so it's letting me save here. I feel like that right there in the distance is something I probably shouldn't be running towards. But hey, why not, right? Oh, yeah. Come in, Theta. Is there an ambulance driving? Come on! Amy, where, where are you? In the field. I had to leave. Call on you? They're all ready to help. Hold on. You got the power automated, right? The, the plant is safe. We need the power to keep the crisis running. Oh, fuck the power! Fuck you, Flashy! The machine killed Carl. Oh shit. Oh, all right. Um, calm down. It'll, it'll be okay. Can you get back to Theta? Yes. Okay. Gonna keep jumping because hey, underwater jumping, the best. I don't think I should be around that. Uh, nah, <laughs> nah, you enjoy yourself, bud. Okay, why? Okay, fine. What, what are you doing? What do you want? You gonna kill me? Or are we gonna talk? Let me talk. Okay, it's not letting me talk to you, so I guess I'm gonna have to leave you. I'm sorry. You're the one who won't talk to me. I tried talking to you, and you just want to buzz me off. So I said no to that. That's the light. The hell is this stupid shuttle I'm supposed to go to? What time is it? 1.24. Yeah, like 30 minutes, maybe. I think I may have came from over here, but I'll go this way. Yeah, I did. I did come from over here. Oh, boy. Where do I go? Okay. Imagine... Imagine somewhere. I mean, that... Freaking uh, robot guy was running around. Or floating around, really. I don't know where he went. It seems like a split. Yeah, what about it? You see me now? What do you want? You don't give me anything. A little what? My god, that guy is such a jerk. He doesn't say anything. Like, what do you want? What do you need? And yet he just, like, stares at me. What? What do you want, moron? You don't do anything for me. That sounds like a personal problem. 
I don't know, because you, you're freaky. <laughs> about right. Figure out where to go. Giant green light over here, so there should be some. Epsilon B. Okay. What? Whoa, hey bud. Hey there, how are you doing? Guess I'm following the robot. Maybe? Am I following you? Looks like you have a gun attached to your face. I don't know. Wait, am I following you or are you following me? No, I think I'm following you. I'm so lost. I don't know, they gotta go over there, so... Okay, yeah, I think he's following me. Alright. Well, they just save him. What does this say? Uh, Epsilon B, I guess. Yeah, he's basically my flashlight. Could be more than that, but for now, get a little flashlight. Okay, don't back off. Like I'm trying to kill you. Like the red robot dude back there. He was totally trying to get you. Hmm. I'm not sure where to go. Oh, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Hmm. It'd be nice if this robot could, you know, actually take me where I need to go. Okay. Bunch of, like, static, so it's as if there's something out here. Oh, what are you? That's yeah, still just Upsilon. I don't need to go to Upsilon, I need to go to Lambda, which is many letters away. Oh, and you're red. I don't trust you. You're red too. Well, it's saving, so I am going to the right place. Shuttle station for Upsilon, for up Upsilon. Okay. Uh, oh. Well, that's very nice. You're a very kind robot. Unlike most of the people here. I mean, you have some robots here that could pass the Turing test, and then you have other ones here that uh, are just plain out jerks. Yeah, that would be nice, wouldn't it? You know what else would be nice? We had lights. Oh. How did I, where did I get a flashlight? That's exactly what I was about to ask. <laughs> okay. Just, hey, uh. Just, like, oh, uh, oh, random flashlight just pops up in front of my face. I have to fix 
Okay. Somebody somebody threw off their helmet. There's a health thing, which I don't need any, but I'll go ahead and get it, I guess. Oh, this time it actually fully grabs my dang finger. Jesus Christ. What the hell? Yeah, that one was way too personal. And sufficient power. What do you want from me? Found the shuttle. It's not enough power for anything. Take all the different pieces, I guess. The tablet. Hmm. Okay. January 12th at 513 in the morning I guess the comet Telus crashed into the Pacific Ocean the impact ranks as one of the largest collisions ever recorded on earth all evidence indicates that the surface has gone completely barren and it's no longer able to sustain life pathos 2's unique location has provided unparalleled safety for our staff some structural damage has been noted but no casualties reported the largest loss was the weather and communication station located on a surface platform. Oh, what about that? Uh, Omega. Which is, under the circumstances, a small price to pay. Theta will hold an emergency meeting to discuss the future of Pathos 2 and ultimately mankind. None on the matter will follow. Or, or more on the matter. I don't know why I read none. <laughs> Overseer K. Or Kieran? Okay. Do we have video? I guess it's a good thing we never had any kids. Hard enough looking my parents in the eyes. Our little mobile home sells real estate, by the way. Along with your dad. I'm guessing someone will help him send you a message somehow. I mean, I hope they will. Hell, I'm not even sure you'll get this message. If you do, I want you to know. This was for Amy, which I don't know where she is. She tried going here the same way I am, but stuff happened. Now I have insufficient power. I'm still yawning. God, I must be like really tired. I still have more stuff to do tonight, so <laughs> I cannot be going to sleep. Oh. Hey, are you? Don't hurt me. Can I help? I'm not going to. Don't let me die. Nothing was about to die. What happened? An accident. Fixing the power. I was going to Theta. Anything I can do? If you see Masters or Holly, tell them I need help. Okay? Amy needs help. Oh boy, so unplugging this would fix the power supply issue, 
But the thing is, it's keeping her from dying. Doing this, you know, it's keeping her from death. Okay, and I guess she's like attached to all the cables and everything? Yeah. Fully attached. I feel like it's another one of those you have to kill options. Oh, man. I just bash you with this. <laughs> it works so much better. Just knock you out. You wouldn't be able to go on along with it. Well, I guess we're killing more people. This one's an actual person instead of a robot. I'm sorry. Are you okay? Are you okay? I don't know. I want to go home. Sorry. And she's dead now. She is dead now. And just like that, power supply is stabled and all that stuff is powered. <sighs> now I'm the monster. I'm the monster that's killing the people. Carl was already dead, but his consciousness got, like moved over to a robot and Amy she got into an accident where she like merged off with like all the other stuff I guess I don't know man well I want to go to Lambda I want to know that for sure why don't I just shut the door I would have, you know, get it to go, or is it just gonna? I mean, I guess not. Oh wait, that's the one I gotta get on. I see. One behind me is nothing. Okay. Uh. Hit the deal is, you know, not working. Oh, that one is though. Yeah, it's activated. Now what? Okay. Yeah, you're activated now, so now what do I do? Do I have to go out here and, like, start it? No? Wait a minute. Settle 6 is in Theta? So, it's gonna take me to Theta. I need it. I need shuttle one, though. So far, the only thing left to do is just to sit down. There's not really a start menu deal here. When I sit down, all it does is just sit me down. It doesn't actually. No, that just get, makes me get back up. Can't pick anything back up. I'm basically stuck right here. There's nothing for me to do. Yep, you got me. So how does it go though? How, do, how does the thing go? It just said standing by. By for what? Oh, I see. I didn't even see the switches there. Never mind.
All right then. That was that. So I need to go to Lambda. ETA two minutes. Welcome to Pathos Two, your express way to the stars. What started as a thermal mining operation in the '60s has now become home to the Omega Space Drive, the world's most affordable way to launch satellites and deep space probes. Our unique Atlantic Ocean location allows for this gigantic coil gun, running longer than a marathon, to safely launch projectiles without risk of damaging the payload with risky combustion. God. Yeah, you're broke. You know, there's an emergency exit switch down there, or lever down there, and I feel like that's exactly what I'm going to have to use. Oh, the track's obstructed. Apparently we did need the emergency exit because uh, <laughs> we went straight through the thing. Okay, then. Actually, no, we didn't go straight through it. Now we did. Great. Well, we're close to Lambda, so that's good news, right? Incoming call. Simon, are you there? Catherine, is that you? I was on my way, but then the shuttle train, it, it fucking crashed. Are you alright? The system says the section is sealed for suspected overuse. No, I'm not alright. What the hell happened to the world? Why are we underwater? Well, you're really out of place, aren't you? Can I walk there? Yeah, but the tunnel is locked off to protect the overall structure from collapsing. What you need to find is your section's maintenance patch. It'll lead outside. Maintenance patch. No problem. What's going on out there? I gotta go. See you soon, Simon. Mm. Catherine? You okay? She literally just said that she's gotta go. See you soon. That basically means that she hung up with you. You're like... Are you okay? Like, moron, she hung up. <laughs> She's not around anymore. <laughs> Freaking hung up on you. Oh yeah, this is where it's just gonna take my entire finger. Oh no, I need to put my entire hand in it. Now it's just getting creepy. I'm telling you, this is getting gross. <laughs> uh, it's a little sexual, if I'm gonna be honest. Okay, is that it? Anything else I need to do here? Said someone needing to find a maintenance hatch. And there is a moth on my wall. That's just great. I swear, there is nothing more ADHD than saying that. <laughs> just be like, oh, you know, uh, there's a moth on my wall. <laughs> right as we're talking about freaking maintenance hatches, which is right here. Okay then. Uh oh. Hmm? Oh. Here we go again. Okay, so now where to go? Do I go in here? No. Uh, what? Oh, the game's like loading. Oh, there you are. Lambda, right? Excuse me, what station is 
Uh, consider we were talking about the Pacific Ocean. That's pretty big. The yeah, Pacific Ocean is pretty huge, buddy. I'm pretty sure that's the largest ocean. Because, uh, yeah. <laughs> pretty sure that's how it works. If I'm not mistaken. So, hmm. You screwed. Though, judging from how far it said at the, uh... I mean, how far the um, thing said that we were from Lambda, we shouldn't be too far. And we're next to, oh, Lambda is in 350 meters. Not too far. It's not even a kilometer. Oh, pretty sure that. As long as that says meter and not mile. <laughs> pretty sure mile would obviously be MI. This game seems like it would run off of the metric system instead of the imperial. Well, Toronto is in... I mean, yeah. I don't know. So, I guess, you know, having it all run off of a... Uh, that makes sense. Oh! I had no idea that was there. My. Jeez, I mean, just freaking show up out of nowhere, you stupid red douche. What the hell did I do to you? I'm just a guy walking underwater. You got a problem with that? Jelly? Lambda, yes. Yep. Freaking tackled. Yeah, I got tackled by a freaking red moron. Great. But what's that noise? Come here! It freaking hits me. All right then. Oh, fine, Captain. Oh boy. Don't look at what? What am I not supposed to be looking at? Down where? Simon, this right thing? Here. Oh. Yeah. Hey, down here. Down where? Woman, you make no sense. Is right this? Oh. No, not you too. I was really hoping you were human. Don't let the circuitry fool you. I was human once. I can't take any more. This is everything's fucked. When I give up, there's nothing left. Calm down. It's not the end of the world. You sure? I sure as hell looks like it. For all I know, there's no one left except for me. What do you mean? I'm right here. Don't take this the wrong way. But I meant any humans left except for me. Have you looked at yourself lately? You're a walking, talking diving suit with some electronics left off to the metric. I think... If you don't want to think about it, we'll start thinking about it. I, I, I don't want to do this anymore. I don't want to be this. I want out. Before you do anything hasty, could you help me with something? What? I was trying to find out what happened with my project when that brute knocked me to the ground. Your 
project? How could anything possibly matter when you know you're a stupid robot in a stupid dead world? Okay, focus. I need you to fix me so I can get back to work. Then you can soak as much as you want. You've got to be kidding, right? I think I have a better chance of building myself a time machine than a pretty robot today. All right, time for plan B. What's plan B? Oh, the Omni tool. The tool you inserted into the terminal. Oh, yeah, the door opener. Yes, you can pull my cortex chip and put it into the Omni tool. What's a cortex chip? It'll be obvious. I'll eject it for you. Just grab the chip and slide it into the Omni tool. Come on. I just, I know you need to do this one thing for me. Yeah, all right. Thanks. Should be easy enough. Just pick up the chip and slide it into the Omni tool. Why does a robot chip put a door opener? It's standardized connection. Uh, Catherine? All right. Let's give this a try. What's the project about? My project? Oh, well, I saved all the people on the station as brain scans and put them into an auto-controlled world. We were going to launch it into space to save, um, uh, well, all of this. Are you telling me that you were going to launch a computer world filled with people into space? Yes. It was just a pet project at first, but it got really serious after the comet took out the surface. Then suddenly it became very important, and it was officially named the Ark. That's appropriate. Mm, everything was named Ark. What did you get? At this rate. I don't know. That version of me that I am. It came from a scan I did pretty early on. The living Catherine could very well have finished the project and launched it. I guess she could even still be alive. Ugh, weird thought. So the talking robots, are they also scans you did? They could be, but I doubt it. I'd expect much more sense if that was the case. Ah, all right, finally. What's happening? I managed to restore some data from the backup server. This should tell us everything we need. Oh. Could you do me a favor and run into the other room and have a look? I don't seem to be able to view the files in this condition. I need to know that the Ark is safe. Sure, Cab. Thanks. I'll unlock the door for you. What was it you said before? You're from Toronto? Yeah, I just went in for a brain scan and suddenly here I am. That doesn't make any sense. How? Why would anyone bring a scan from Toronto? You think that's strange? What if I tell you it was back in 2015? Whoa. Just, whoa. <laughs> like, uh, yeah, it's more than just a whoa. It's more like, oh, so you're like, you know, super old. <laughs> Something? Sorry, still trying to figure out how you got here. Let's keep at it. I'd really like to know who thought sending a Canadian to the bottom of the sea was a good idea. <laughs> That's a good point. saying just not to look at it or was it just saying you know stay away from it pretty sure that's both totally both right totally just uh yeah i don't need that right now my health is in okay condition This is where I came out of. Said she wanted me to go check out the other room. What happened before? That creature was strangely. Yeah, it basically exploded with electromagnetism. That's bad, right? Confusing, at least. Here's the sense is a good punch. Hmm. Again, another healing bit, which I don't need health right now. Check the computer. Yes, look for anything about the arc. Huh. 
I just figured out about it. Not here shortly, I'll be ending stream. Just gonna check all this stuff out. Okay. And a view too. What are your thoughts? Ian Peterson. The arc. It's a great idea. And we have something to do, am I right? Are you optimistic about the project's chances of some about the arc reaching space? Well, it can definitely be done. You already solved the biggest problem. How to actually get us all in there. Now all we have to do is build the dam. Okay. Is that the end of the... I'm gonna say this is the end of the interview? What are your thoughts Mark Saring. on the art project? The idea is just incredible. By every definition. <laughs> it really makes you think about what it means to be human. What makes you say that? Beyond the basics. Beyond the superficial. I'm convinced there's something with even greater value. You have provided a platform which is not necessarily restricted to our digital progeny, but a means of actual survival. It's my sincerest belief that we can go on living in the reality of continuity. Well, I mean, it's basically like, you know, you're copying yourself, but it's like a copy of that exact self. You know, it's it's a way like making a backup of yourself, you know, if say you cr you s did the brain scan it created that backup of yourself of that current moment all the memories from then you know from then and before like your life so far that's the backup and you know if you if your actual human body dies you have that backup it's there and i'm pretty sure it probably can't be copied it probably can be but it'd be a little weird but i don't know it's all that kind of crap Yes, I'm a nerd. Get over it. Eh, I mean, in reality, it's... Yes, um. that's some early renders of the world inside. Looks a whole lot comfier than this place. Okay. Honestly, though, I'm not really sure getting a backup of yourself is probably the best idea, though. Hmm, let's see. Uh, I mean, let's we'll stick with normal. Grab your middle condition. Let's see. I mean, he still feels normal. I want to go by his deals, not mine. Grab your senses. I'd say he probably has that. Huh. I don't care what form I take as long as I get to carry on. That's at least something to go for. I mean, just if you can imagine, though, the whole backup. I mean, this guy, Simon, basically just got backed up and from the previous brain scan, like way before, the first ever brain scan. And he kept living, and now we're his copy. Yay.
Jeez, that's a harsh one. I found a tracker honed in on the arc. Oh, that's clever. Hmm. I wonder if I thought of that. Does it still work? I really need to know what happened to it. I think so. It's doing something at least. Where is it? Hold on. I'm trying to find it. Got to figure out where it is on Earth. How? Or tally or whatever. Oh my god, how many of this do I need to scan? And there we go. I found it. It's at a site named Tau. Oh no, it's on Earth. It's so close to Phi, they almost made it. Damn it, it won't make it for long in that state. A couple of decades at most. We got to. Could, could we get on the ark? I suppose, but I'm not exactly flexible at the moment. Oh, well, there you go. I can move, jump, swim, sort of. You're stuck in the door opening, the Omni Pool. I'll just carry you there and you'll show me what to do. That looks really risky. Besides, I don't like the idea of you carrying me around. Come on, Catherine. This is what you wanted to do. Your final mission. Let's launch the Ark. We'd need to find a way to get into the Abyss. Can't take the climber without a power suit. We probably have to go to Theta and pray the Dunbat's still working. Okay, shall we go to Theta? <sighs> I don't know. It's pretty far. Catherine, look around. What else is there to do? Maybe there's still a working shuttle thing that can take us to Theta. I doubt it. Just have a look around. Push comes to shove, I'll walk then. Okay then, I'll do some text on this thing. Don't forget to take me with you. I won't forget. Okay, so where is your body again? I mean, where's your thing again? I completely lost her already. Where did you go? I'm waiting. Well, I'm trying to find you. Dang, jerk. Jerk lady. Can I pull the Omni tool out? Wait, wait, wait. Okay, just be sure to plug me in again at some point. You got it. Good luck, Simon. Well, it'd be like a good way to save an exit. Yes. And that is it. All right. That is going to be the end of this stream. Kind of a quick one, not really. I mean, it's like an hour, hour and a half. I don't actually know. Let me check that. Literally telling it to type. I want to kill this thing. I'm really going to kill it. I cannot type on the dumb... There we go. It freaking... Alright. Sorry about that. I was trying to type in chat and it was like lagging, kind of. 
It just basically wouldn't. I didn't think it was typing, but I guess it did. So sorry for the spam, the four message spam, but almost two hours. I'd say that's good enough. Anyway, thank you all for watching, and we'll probably continue this game sometime in the future. I don't know. It depends on what everybody wants after we get done finishing uh, Last of Us. So, yeah. All right, that is it. So, thank you all for watching, which was only Architect a tiny bit, I guess, and Sweden before he left. Yeah.